Welcome aboard the Walder's New Product Express for September 2024. Whether you're a veteran model railroader, just getting started, or anywhere in between, we have an exciting selection of model train products to show you this month, starting with a workhorse third generation diesel. New from Walder's Mainline, a General Motors Electromotive Division SD60 diesel hits HO scale rails this winter. The EMD SD60 debuted in the mid-1980s. Its 3,800 horsepower engine positioned it as a heavy hauling powerhouse for decades. Many units served into the 21st century with some SD60s still in service today. The latest Walder's Mainline SD60 models and early production Spartan cab version of the locomotive with standard width cab and hood sides. The body shell features sharply molded grills and other details along with drill starter points for those that wish to add grab irons and handrails that are included with the Walder's Mainline EMD SD50 SD60 detail kit that sold separately. Under the hood the model features the same top of the line drivetrain as Walder's Proto locomotives including a five-pole motor with dual brass flywheels, helical gears, and a heavy die-cast metal chassis. LED lighting and metal Protomax knuckle couplers ensure that these SD60s will be hauling freight on your railroad for years to come. And new for this run, standard DC versions now include a pre-installed speaker that makes it easy to convert the model to DCC sound using the decoder of your choice. This new run of Spartan Cab SD60s is available in two numbers each, of sound and DCC and standard DC versions of the following road names. Canadian Pacific, CITX, Kansas City Southern, New York, Susquehanna and Western, Oakway and Sioux Line. If you're looking for something for those new SD60s to haul, check out these new coal cars from Walder's Mainline. The prototypes for these Walder's Mainline 50-foot gondolas are the Pullman Standard 4,000 cubic foot high side gondolas that were built in the 1970s and 1980s. The PS 4000s could be found in long unit coal trains as well as single cars traveling in mixed freights. Over their long careers, many of these cars were later used in scrap service. The Walder's mainline models feature separately applied brake gear and interior bracing. The cars ride on prototypically correct 36 scale inch metal wheels and include metal Protomax knuckle couplers for reliable operation. For those that wish to add coal loads to their gondolas, be sure to check out Chooch Flexible Coal Loads. These loads are available in three different textures and can be easily trimmed and mounted on sheet styrene to create custom loads for all your favorite Walder's open freight cars. This new run of PS4000 gondolas features three new road numbers each of the following road names. Burlington Northern, Consumers Power, Detroit Edison, Joseph Transport, Fayette Power Project, and Southern Railway. For those looking for some classic intermodal freight, you don't want to miss these new 89-footers. Walder's mainline 89-foot channel side flat cars model the class F89F flat cars owned by Trailer Train and many railroads beginning in the 1960s. These versatile cars revolutionized intermodal freight with their ability to carry 28-foot, 40-foot, 45-foot, 48-foot, and 53-foot trailers. If you're modeling the last few decades of the 20th century, you'll definitely want a few of these flats on your roster. These HO scale models capture the prototype's distinctive C-channel side sills and feature separately applied brake gear. To ensure reliable performance, loaded or empty, the cars have a heavy die-cast metal underframe, metal Protomax knuckle couplers, and 33 scale inch RP25 metal wheels. To top off your flat cars, you'll also want to check out the wide variety of compatible trailers available from Walder's Scene Master. The Walder's mainline channel side flat cars are coming soon with new factory printed road numbers in the following schemes. TTX in eight new road numbers, KTTX brown and yellow schemes in four road numbers each, and JTTX in four new numbers. Last up for Walder's Mainline this month is the ever-popular Pullman Standard PS2 Covered Hopper. 
First built by Pullman Standard in the 1960s, the 50-foot PS2 CD 4427 covered hopper served throughout the North American rail network for decades. These big and colorful cars could be found handling all types of grains, animal feed, and similar loads at a variety of trackside industries. A few examples are still in service today. The Walders model captures the spotting features of this long-serving hopper, including its 434 exterior rib pattern. The HO car also features separate bottom discharge gate details and see-through running boards. Like all Walder's mainline rolling stock, the hoppers also include metal Protomax knuckle couplers and prototypically correct 36 scale inch metal wheels. The PS2 CD 4427 hoppers are available in four numbers each of the following road names. Archer Daniels Midland, Cargill, Denver and Rio Grande Western, Indiana Farm Bureau, Agway, CMA, Continental Grain Company, and Western Maryland. Moving on to Walder's Proto, I have some head-end equipment to show you that's sure to interest both classic and modern era modelers. Walder's Proto heavyweight baggage cars and baggage railway post office cars are back. These HO scale models replicate steel passenger cars that served on passenger trains from the 1920s into the 1970s. Many heavyweight cars were also rebuilt for maintenance away work train service at the end of their careers. Railway post office baggage cars also include an authentic interior with details such as mailbag stanchions and sorting cases. For both the baggage and baggage RPO cars, clerestory and arched roof versions are available as appropriate for each road name. And all cars feature a detailed underbody and ride on accurate six-wheel heavyweight style trucks with metal RP25 wheels and metal Protomax knuckle couplers. We're really excited to bring these heavyweight cars back the RPO baggage is available in two numbers each of the following schemes, Chesapeake and Ohio Green, Chesapeake and Ohio Tricolor, New York Central, Illinois Central, and Union Pacific. The heavyweight baggage car is available in two numbers each for Chesapeake and Ohio Green, Chesapeake and Ohio Tricolor, New York Central, Maintenance of Way, and Union Pacific. Painted and unlettered versions are also available with either arched or clerestory roofs for both the baggage RPOs and baggage cars. And for those looking to add head-end equipment to their more modern Amtrak trains, we also have you covered. Walder's Proto 73-foot Bud Baggage Cars make the perfect addition to Walder's Proto Amfleet coaches and other Walder's Amtrak equipment. The models are based on prototypes built by the Bud Company that served on Amtrak's long-distance passenger trains from the early 1970s into the 21st century. The model features accurately fluted sides, window tinting, and factory installed grab irons. The models also include sprung diaphragms and separate underbody details. Like all Waller's Proto passenger cars, the Bud baggage cars have metal RP25 wheels and metal Protomax knuckle couplers for reliable operation. Officially licensed by Amtrak, the Walder's Proto 73-foot Bud Baggage Cars are available decorated in the following prototypical Amtrak paint schemes. Phase 1, Phase 2, Phase 3, Phase 4 with white lettering, Phase 4 with black lettering, and Phase 6. There are two factory printed road number versions as well as one unnumbered version for each paint scheme. The unnumbered version includes user applied number decals. Are you looking for an easier way to uncouple your detailed passenger cars and other rolling stock without knocking a car off the rails or breaking a grab iron? If so, then this next product is for you. The all new Walders Controls Manual Uncoupler is easy to install on new or existing layouts. This accessory allows you to disengage the magnetic couplers on your HO scale cars without having to use an uncoupling tool or lifting a car off the rails. Simply roll the cars you wish to uncouple over the uncoupler, flip the switch, and the cars are separated. The manual uncoupler is compact and fits under layout benchwork. The device can be used with scale track on separate roadbed or all-in-one track with built-in roadbed. It works with both Code 100 and Code 83 track. Use several uncouplers on the ladders of your train yards or at industry sidings to help your layout operate smoother than ever before. Look for the new Walders Controls Manual Uncoupler at your favorite hobby shop in winter 2025. Now I'm going to turn things over to Anthony and he's going to tell you about some exciting new products from Walders Trainline. Thanks, Dana. Let's switch tracks and take a look at those new Walters Trainline releases. 
Looking to expand your power lock track layout? The Walther's Trainline Power Lock Figure 8 Set is your all-in-one solution. This set includes everything you need to create a dynamic figure 8 track arrangement. Perfect for both beginners and seasoned modelers with new and improved snap-together design. No tools or rail joiners required. The terminal re railer is included in this set and we're also offering it separately. This gives you the flexibility to add re railers to your existing layouts or to have spares on hand for future expansions. Whether you need just one or want to integrate several into a larger custom setup, the choice is yours when they arrive this fall. Thanks for joining us on the Walters New Product Express. All of these products are available for pre-order at your local hobby shop. You can also head over to our website, walters.com, to get more detailed information on each. See you next time.